<laughs> Goodbye, Sarah. Oh, I almost forgot. To get to the shrine, or whatever is left of it, just take this road a little farther to the east and follow the path into the mountains. Goodbye, Avatar. May the virtues guide you. Okay. Hey, hey, hey. The hell? Like two of them dying or something? Is that a wisp? Whoa. This isn't the way I'm supposed to be going. Get back here. I don't know why tooltips aren't working. Cause I can't I can't tell what fucking anything is. Anyway, to the shrine. I'll see what the shrine will probably send me on a quest. Ah, oh, I've been poisoned. Avatar, on your way to the dungeon of despise. That's the guy in the photo. How did you know I was going to despise? Well, it's just down the road a bit, and you being the Avatar, it just made sense that you'd be doing a bit of adventuring. You're the adventurer. Do you have any suggestions for what I'll need in despise? Make sure you've got some good, sturdy armor and a strong sword. Some healing potions would help, and a bow is always a good idea. You're likely to run into all manner of beasts in that pit. Plus, you know what I always do before going down there. I go and meditate at the shrine for peace and wisdom. How do I find the dungeon? Follow this path north and seek the entrance in the mountains to the east. If you pass that infernal column, you've gone too far. Farewell. I need to go to the shrine then, don't I? That was a subtle hint that before you go to the dungeon, you should go to the shrine. It is so good to see you. Oh, I wish that YOLO were here. I hope all is well with you. That's Gwenna, right, okay. Where is YOLO? Oh, Avatar, I'm so worried about him. Lord British sent him down to Despise to investigate that column, and he hasn't come back. Just it's send been a pensioner a very down long there. time now, and I'm worried. I told him that he was too old to be off exploring at all, let alone by himself. But he wouldn't listen to me. Do you think that you could look for him, Avatar? 
Britain seems to have changed. They're sending the sick people to pause. Yes, but it's all for the best, really. Can you tell me anything about the columns? I'm afraid that I don't know much about them. I do think that they're evil, though. There's something about them, and it's not good. The fact that it's so near despise is a clear indication to me that it's malevolent. Oh, obviously. What's it like inside despise these days? Well, I haven't been down there in ages, but I suspect that it hasn't changed too much. The spies has always been full of unpleasant monsters, but nothing too terrible. You'll run into a few giant spiders and whatnot, but I certainly don't think that you'll find any demons down there. Goodbye, Gwenno. Goodbye, Avatar. Is this when did YOLO live near Britain, anyway? What? What is going on here? I'm just burgling you. Alright. Sun's going down. She said it was follow it to the east and then go up into the mountains. There we go. So I'm probably going to have to stop. Just have to move. Got to the shrine. Right. Shrine. Avatar. Oh. It is I, Shamano. I'm glad to see that you have returned to Britannia. I fear that I will need your help to do the same. Shamano, where are you? I've been trapped in the spirit realm. Until I'm able to return to Britannia in physical form. I have to speak to you through these stones of spirituality. Of course you do. You will find them throughout the land. Speaking to you in this manner is very draining. So I'll be brief. A great deal has happened since you were last here. You are probably aware of the columns that have appeared. When they first came out of the ground, I felt that there was something very sinister about them. So I undertook a spiritual quest to learn more. I learned that a magical force of great power deliberately created the columns. There are eight columns, Avatar, and they are twisting the eight sacred virtues. They have turned compassion into hatred, justice into injustice, and so on. The people of the cities that represent the virtues have been corrupted by the columns' influence. It's not their fault, Avatar. They're still good people. They just need your help to restore their ways. I must leave now, my friend. The tether that binds me to this world grows threadbare. There is more that I need to tell you, but it must wait. Of course it must. Shaman, oh wait! I need to ask you some questions. We'll talk again, Avatar. Farewell. Well, shit. But at least we know we're on the right track for the shrine. We hope. Oh. Not looking so good. Whoa. Very well, not looking so good. Speak now the mantra of compassion. No. Who? No. no. Compassion, compassion, no. car. Thou hast failed. You lack compassion. Go for. Speak now the mantra compassion. of bear. compassion. Not bah, bear. Thou hast oh, failed. Oh, fuck it. I can't remember it. 
compassion. Speak now the mantra of compassion. No. Who unlocked ah. the mystery? Should have gone with what I first said. Ah, son of sons, the avatar. You have come to arrest the growth of the guardian's columns that emerged from the eight dungeons. Gather you two important tools. Inside each dungeon is a glyph of corruption. Formerly a rune of virtue, but altered mm -hmm. through evil magic. Find this glyph and couple it with the sigil, which embodies the virtues. The sigil of compassion is the sacred heart of compassion nice. and resides with Britain's mayor. Finally, place these items upon the altar in the center of the shrine and utter the sacred mantra. These two keys will allow the unknotting of corruption. Okay, and I'm going to have to do that for every shrine, aren't I? Right. Wow, this place is fucked. Okay, so we shall save it here. And I'll have to continue another day. But, okay, we're getting there. Good start. Off to a good start. Apart from the cutscenes and the crashing. But, we'll pick it up soon. The next day. The spies. Gotta remember where the hell it is. Okay. Oh, so if that's the shrine, what the hell's that? Where oh, the moon gate was. Don't recall moon gate ever being in a Oh, hang on, I suppose I'll seven. What do we need to speak Adar, about? We need to speak. I am glad you are here, Avatar. I need your help. Lord British had four new lighthouses built. This one and three others in Moonglow, Buccaneer's Den, and Trinsic. The magic gemstones that were to be used as lenses for the other three lighthouses never arrived. I expect that they may I've be got one. scattered That's what across that white Britannia be. by now. Without the lighthouses, we are having more shipwrecks than ever before. I need you to recover the unpolished ruby, sapphire, and emerald gemstones and take them to the gem cutter in Britain so that he can finish polishing them. Then, they need to be placed within the lighthouses themselves to activate them. I, I urge you, friend Avatar, be quick, for we are losing more ships every day. This is a genuine query. Why the fuck do I have to do it? Which gems go with which lighthouses? The ruby lens is to be placed in the lighthouse in Buccaneer's Den. The emerald should be taken to Moon Glow, and the sapphire belongs in the Trinsic Lighthouse. But all the stones must be polished by the gem cutter before they will work okay, properly. I will do as you ask. Farewell. 
Thank you, Avatar. Why the fuck I've got to do it? I don't know. Oh god, you really? Bags only old nine things. As I go up, I think my ears are going to start bleeding. Hi, <laughs> Dad. Oh. Fine, everything's fine. It's not actually working and it's dark. Just like to point that out. Oh, fuck up. Right. Let's go find the donjon. Went a bit dizzy there. I tried to move my head whilst running. So, as I said, I'm playing this completely uh, vanilla. But um, I think I will try out the beautiful Britannia mod and let you see what that's like afterwards. Since I've showed you the, the graphics for different settings at, before I start playing the game, I'll do this one at the end just to be consistent. Consistently random. The whole reason my game channel was called Random Gaming is because I literally I have no plan. So where's the column? I think that might be it. Uh, <laughs> uh, that's the guy. Stupid thing. That's the guy from the opening video that was crushed when the uh, when the rock fell off the top. So we can surmise that the, the one we saw rise out of the ground was uh, near Britain. That's the entrance to the dungeon and there's the collar. Rats keep coming.
Good job that the dungeons are well maintained, aren't they, with torches and stuff like that. Wow. Gonna guess poisoned. Ah. Okay. Rat gold. Would you rather spend your time with that madman in the winged armor? I'm sure he'd love to have you over for dinner. Who's there? Please help us! Thank you for freeing us. What can we do to repay you? Who are you? I'm Castro, and this here's Felix. We live in Britain. Or at least we did live in Britain until they decided to shove all the poor people away to pause. What a disgusting swamp. That's why we decided to risk coming to the dungeon to look for the Kieran Stone. I guess we thought we could buy the right to stay in Britain. What is this Kieran Stone? A magic artifact was hidden here and despised decades ago. The Kieran Stone is the key and was hidden in four pieces within this dungeon. We don't know for sure of what the item is, was. but we came here hoping it would be valuable. After this past week, though, I don't care about the money anymore. Felix and I are going back to Britain to find something to eat. Where might I find the pieces of the stone? A part of the Kieran Stone lies atop the greatest pillar in the pillar room. And I know I won't be looking for it anymore. Our two friends, Thaddeus and Morden, were also in the dungeon looking for the stone. Each one of us had the location of one of the stones. So if you can find them, you'll find the other two parts of it. All I know is there's supposed to be a piece behind a wall of water. You may not be able to find all four pieces if Thaddeus and Morden have already found theirs. But you never know. They may have left a long time ago. Thanks for the information. Goodbye. Oh no, no, I'm locked in here with you. 